What's good, my peoples? This is the Plant Lady in the Projects. So today's episode is all about my greenhouse and what it's done for me within the week of my growth. And I'll show you guys that in a moment. But we are going to be looking at the greenhouse here. So as you see, you see that silver paper in there? That's the Mylar paper. I finally got my Mylar paper in the mail, so I'm excited for that. Just have this here, but I'm going to have to get a new one. This, I don't even think this thing works or anything like that, so, yeah. Um, so, this is what it looks like on the inside. It gives you that extra light that you need, which I really love. This Mylar paper. I forget who I heard talking about this, and don't put use aluminum. And I was kind of worried about using aluminum anyway, because it could do probably do something to your plant. So, I heard it, I'm glad I heard about this Mylar paper. It gives you extra light also when you turn your lights on. So that's what these look like here. Now, let me take this one off so I can show you what else I have in here. And I have these mats from the Dollar Tree car mats, and they fit in here perfect. As you can see, there's no overlay of them or extra overlay on the back, which is good. So I use these for, like, dirt if it falls or extra water if it falls out and it just can catch it for me, which I really like these because they fit in here perfect. I get those from the Dollar Tree. Okay, that's just the car mats for the floor. And then I just cut some more Mylar paper and put them on each of my shelves. It's like I have extra light in there. So that's what they look like. Let me turn the light on in here for you so you can see what it looks like. And instead of doing one uh, video of my plant, of the uh, plants once a week, I'll be doing it twice a week because there's so much that goes into planting. And so much happens over a course of planting when they're growing and things like that and so yeah so friday so this is what oops i'm sorry so this is what it looks like with the lights on my my um the extra cords the cords that come with them they're kind of too short for me to stick them this way so i have to get another set because i'm going to stick another set back there so the lights can be beaming off so that's what it looks like so i have each set of lights in here like that and it still gives me a lot of light in there extra light see how the light bounces off the mylar paper so yeah i did get that so i have to get some more and i have one light down there hopefully it heats, it's heating up the bottom so yeah that's what i got for there and then we're gonna go outside guys see that my plants outside so i can show you guys how my plants are blooming we're coming out there looking so nice. I cannot wait. I'm excited. Can't wait to eat off of our vegetation. And my family going to enjoy the fruits of our Lord. So there you go. That's what it looks like. I ordered this. Um, I, I do definitely want to get another one of these. Because I'm really, really enjoying these. So I ordered this greenhouse off of Amazon. You can, I mean, off of eBay. You can get them off of Amazon, eBay, you know. So, yeah. That's what it looks like. I am an indoor gardener, but I take my plants outside to get sun. I don't plant them in the ground. They stay in containers. Because um, I live, you know, where I live, you know, so I cannot be gardening outside, digging up these people's ground. So, yeah. So, I'm an indoor, indoor gardener, but I bring my plants outside so I can get some sun, the sun that it needs, at least six to eight hours. And I bring them back in when they come in here. Now we're going to go outside and look at my beautiful plant. Lair Farmer 73, this is for you. I got this plant. I'm so excited that you were talking about this plant because I always wanted a banana plant. And this is because of you. So I got the Musa, uh, Musa Truly Teeny Banana Plant. I cannot wait to plant her. Look how beautiful she looks. She looks gorgeous. Yes. Beautiful, guys. Um, I got her off of eBay for $13.99. She's absolutely gorgeous. I cannot wait to plant her. Lead Farmer <clears throat> 73, you guys rock. I'm all, I'm so happy that I did get this plant, so I cannot wait to plant her. She's absolutely beautiful. I can't wait to unwrap her and see what her roots look like. 
Um, so I'm not sure if you're supposed to leave this on and just plan it like this. So if you guys know, please let me know. And if you're watching Lead Farmer 73, please let me know. Am I supposed to uh, leave this like this when I take it out this plastic and just uh, bury it like that or what? So I'm excited, guys. So we're going to go outside right now and check out the other plants and see how they're doing. But yeah, that's my plant. I'm so excited, guys. All right, guys, so we're outside. So I just planted some carrots, but um, I'm going to uh, plant these over in a bigger pot, in a different pot, in a rounder pot. So I just wanted to start the seeds off. So there you are. Those are what's going on. I just planted those on the 28th, right? And over here, guys, look at my beautiful kale. They're coming up so nice. Guys, remember the first day I showed you these guys? On the 23rd, look at that. Beautiful. They're coming up so nicely. Um, I did depot some of them already and put some in water. I put two in water because I'm going to try something different, some hydro plants. And then I put two, three of them in soil. But look at that, guys. Aren't they amazing? I'm so excited for those. And then look at my onions. They're growing up so nicely. You see the new ones here. <laughs> Yeah, and that was one back there. So they're growing up really nice and they taste so good and fresh. That's what I love about gardening. Let's go around here. Then I have some peas coming up in here, guys. So I made me a nice little trellis. You can get these trellises from the Dollar Tree. It's just one I just put two together. But you can get those from the Dollar Tree. I'm so sorry about the sun. I'm happy for the sun, though. We haven't had sun in three days here. <laughs> so I'm excited for the sun. So these are my peas. That'll be growing up soon. And over here, I have my tomato plant here. If you can see, I made another trellis, trellis here. Also, that's to my tomato plant. And I don't know if you guys can see in there, but I have some babies growing up. I'm so excited for. All right. And then these are the kale that's just being uh, grown in water. So I'm going to try these out and see how they do. I forget what's in there. Okay, and these are my other kales that I replanted right here. Put three in there. See how they're going to go. And then here we got some Swiss chard. I just buried in there recently. So, got to wait for those to grow out. And then, guys, look at here, guys. Oh, I wish you guys could see. There you go. The sun is just, there we go. Cucumber. Look at that. So on Friday, we're going to be moving these into new pots. All right, guys? I'm so excited. And this was on the 24th. And look at that already. Cucumber, guys. Cucumber seems to grow up really, really quickly. All right? So then I got some of my oregano growing up. And I got some sweet basils growing up in there. And I also got some mixed uh, nest sage here, which is really nice. And we got some sweet basil right here. And then we got, look at that, guys, cantaloupe, guys, cantaloupe, cantaloupe. I cannot wait, guys. Look at this. Beautiful. And then over here, who is this, baby? This is the Spanish variety pepper that's growing up. I'm excited, so excited. And this baby is the yellow squash. Guys, I'm just so excited. This is so relaxing. This is the cabbage that's growing up. Um, I think this is oregano. Yeah, sage. <clears throat> so, guys, I am so, like, excited and ecstatic that... Oh, look at that. That's another Spanish variety pepper growing up in there. So teeny. But I'm excited, and I'm so sorry, guys, if you really couldn't see anything because of the sun... But I'm happy because the sun is finally out. We haven't had sun in three days, so so excited. So that's what all my plants are looking like so far, guys. Excited.